I do. Um, some of them will be personal stories. Um, when I talk to people, um, especially like the bank employees, um, you know, people get loans from us and bad things happen to people. That's, that's, that's just life. Mm -hmm. uh, but the reality is most people will get through whatever that bad point is, that bad spot in their life, um, and they'll get back on track and things will work out well. Mm -hmm. So I always try to stress with our employees, the sooner we find out that somebody's having problems, the sooner we can have a positive impact in terms of, you know, if they have a loan with us. And I know everybody thinks bankers are, are mean and cruel and, and uh, all of that, but we do have a lot of things we can do. We can lower their payment, we can lower their interest rate, we can give them a period of time where they don't have to make a payment. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of things that we can do. And if you look at the number one reason most people have financial difficulty, it's health. Mm -hmm. uh, it's either their own health or their loved one. Mm -hmm. And either case, it's very impactful because um, one, you're incurring medical costs. So your bills are racking up and you're expending a lot of your resources to try to get deal with your health issue. And then the second one is income is interrupted, mm -hmm. either your own income or the person who was ill's income. And so now all of a sudden you've got to supplement you know, their living expenses. Mm -hmm. But people get healthy again, they get back to jobs and they get back mm -hmm. working again and they get through it. And so the example that I give is my wife uh, had cancer. And at the time that she had cancer, the kids were little, and I was freaking out over how am I going to get them to school, how am I going to get them to uh, all their activities, i got to get the laundry, i got to make dinner, and i got to work, and i got to mow the lawn, and you know, i got to do everything that two people were doing, now I have to do so my wife can concentrate on, plus i got to get her to all her stuff. And a lot of people came and helped me. And I remember came home one time and the lawn was mowed. And you mm -hmm. think, you know, like, what, you know, is that a big deal? But it was. And so I said, you know, when you reach out to people when they need you more than, you know, you need them, uh, that's when you can cement relationships. Mm -hmm. So if we can reach out to our customers when they're in trouble and help them, mm -hmm. we can probably cement them as customers for life. So that would be an example of where I would draw on a personal story mm -hmm. to try to echo my point, which is just because someone's struggling now making their loan payments doesn't make them a bad customer. Mm -hmm. And in fact, if we can get them through this, they'll probably be a customer for life.